What's up folks, welcome to Wasted Space, and welcome back to The Zone. I have said the intro to this episode like 15 times now. Recording 36.5, that little highlight's real, that all went wrong, and then, as those of you who follow me on Twitter will know, re-recording this episode in its entirety, and then doing another one after it, all of which with my mic muted. So I'm not going to pretend like I haven't done any of this stuff, I've done quite a bit. So let's just get on with it, and we'll begin by paying our respects to the poor weapons trader. This truly is like the cursed episode. It starts off with saying goodbye to this friend who I accidentally shot in, what, two episodes ago now. There's no way of getting him back either. I don't have a sensible save. I'd have to go miles back over into the darkscape and so on, because I was still doing stuff at the end of last episode, like trading weapons and so on. So, we reap what we sow. He's dead. That's, that's it. No more weapons upgrading from him. Him? I had nothing to do with I, I am wiping my hands clean of this. I did not kill the musician. I don't know why he's dead. I don't know who killed him. One of the guys, I suppose, if you take into account he was standing like here. And they all came wandering down that. Yeah, I can see why he's dead. I don't think he was very useful. He was just the musician that we could gamble with. So, yeah. Whatever. So be it. What we are going to do is go for a little bit of revenge. Because, Ribwenge. Because we can't upgrade anything. But what we can, as you can see, I was looking around at the start of the episode, the AK-74N3 is the one with the mount on it for attaching scopes and so on. So I want it, as well as the briefcase with the docks, which doesn't reward 2,000 rubles, like I thought. Rewards 15,000 rubles and a gun. So we are going down there, and that means, means I'm going to get pushed around by that guy, dude, who could lend me his armor sometime, perhaps. And that means we're going to switch around what we're carrying, ditch some of this weight, carry back more loot, and go on a bit of a killing spree. I just haven't... I don't think we need underslung grenade launcher rounds. Uh, so let's take the snipper, let's take you, let's take whatever our best armour is. Anything else? That might be enough. Unless we want to take a better gun than this AK. I'm not sure we've got one. Not really. No, that's what we're taking then. Roger. We really did make a bit of a pig's ear of that mission. <laughs> people everywhere. So let's go and make some of our own. And the mission here, the goal here, is to take out the stupid speaker, which is making all that damn noise and will only get more and more and more annoying the longer this goes on. But also to deal with them quick enough that I can escape the helicopter that arrives. Now, well, the rule with the helicopter, I know, at this point, is that it will go away when everybody is dead. However, because people like to fall over and be still alive, that's not quite as easy as it might sound. So first up, let's find ourselves a vantage point. We've got these three that patrol, and then there's some in the right building, some in the left building, some in the rear building, and two that are kind of just sitting out the front. Yeah, there's one of them. First up, I want to try and find a good spot to get this speaker from. And there isn't a... A spot I found yet that's sort of perfect for this. But the speaker sits on the side of this building in a sort of an annoying spot that's really hard to see. It's there somewhere. There's a guy sort of standing on a platform here with an AK as well. Show me the speaker, damn it. This is where I get spotted and shot just wandering back because I'm forward zoomed in isn't it I know how you're gonna cheat me this now this is not helping there's more trees in the way I'm gonna have to go across actually cross over the road maybe it's a shame this this hill provides quite a good vantage point you know, it's nice and clear but if I can't get a line on that speaker I'm not keen to do it again it's, it's about here Come on, just give me a little glimpse. Those guys turned around? Yes. I'm going to get surprised by them trying to cross the road. Is there a spot from here? Come on. Is that it? I think I can see it. I think it's there. This is not the world's most protected location. I'm pretty sure that is it. Go on then, this is slightly dodgy, but... Just, oh, is, does it turn around? Have I now lost it? 
It looks like it does move around, actually. It's just, yeah, it's just there. Those three are getting awfully close. Screw it. In the head. In the head. Oh, God, I should have reloaded. I only got one of them in the head as well. That was not as much in the head as I'd hoped. It's like, he's not dead. He's getting an extra shot. He's getting an extra shot. You, sir, can get shot as well. He's not dead either. More of these that I can confirm killed. Whoa! More of these I can confirm kill. The better it's going to go when the chopper comes. Did he just fall down as well? Yeah, he's not dead either, are you? And you, sir. No, not doing that. And that's the noise of the chopper. It's coming from dead ahead. <laughs> there it is. It's angry. It's very angry. Holy crap, that's a lot of them. Sounds like for now they don't know where I am. They've lost me again. Which is kind of fortuitous. Oh, I, I take that back. Where's the close-up guy? There is someone like right here. I heard you. Have a grenade. Got him. Alright, so while that chopper's happy to do that, we need to get these guys taken out from out front. I love how sometimes they, they just drop immediately and sometimes they take ages. Come on. Hit them wasted. Actually shoot them in the face. What on earth? Come on now. At least I'm actually getting them down this time. Where's the close-up you? And there's another one there. Just listening to this chopper. Where's the close guy? I want to save, just in case. Um, there's the close guy. Holy hell. I did think I saw two. It certainly makes things easier if they're just going to come and sort of be kind of dumb in front of me. Is that the noise of the chopper leaving? No, no, that's not the noise of the chopper leaving. It's right there, wasted. Right there. If it spots you, it shoots you through the trees. So I don't know why I'm hiding the other side of the tree. <laughs> it really doesn't make any difference. Do you think I killed all these guys? Jammed weapon, not helpful. You all dead? Go away, Mr. Chopper, please. I've had enough. That, there's no way that's it either. If they've all come to me, that would be ridiculous. Because that's certainly not what happened last time. It has gone. That chopper's left. Woot! Okay, they, they literally all came out and just came and decided they were going to face tank me. Okay, if, if you say so. That's, I'm fine with that. Grab some AK ammo. Took me a lot longer the last time, I can tell you that much. I suppose it probably helps knowing exactly what's required to make the chopper go away. <laughs> uh, probably missed some bodies doing this, haven't I? Yep, there's one. This one up here. Did you right? Cool. Well, off we go then. Down to the army camp. Don't need water. Do need to reload. 
kill anyone on the left side of the road? Not really. No one came up that close. It all ended up being right side. More ammo. Be vaguely aware that I'm probably still wandering around in minefield territory. There is uh, what condition. All of these are going to be in really beat up nick, aren't they? However, if I get a couple of them, I can probably repair one and they're going to be better than the thing I'm using. One of these other guys had one on him as well, didn't he? At least I think he did. this one. Okay, yeah, between the two of those, I can make one fully repaired barrel 5, and the barrel 5 is pretty decent, if I remember rightly. It's got built-in MBGs and stuff. Uh, bulletproof vest. Oh, maybe it doesn't have them built-in MBGs. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's that other one. Okay. Sure, did we do this fella? Yeah, we did. You've been done. No, we didn't. I lie. Bodies everywhere and an empty army base. For now, it does repopulate itself, unfortunately. It's not like they're permanently gone. Still managed to do that one. Ah, saying that, not all of... Keep, I'm going past the ammo because some of this is... Yeah, it's 18 mil. I don't need 18 mil. I need 19 mil. Quite handy to get our hands on some of that at some point soon. More ammo of the wrong type. This is kind of just validating why I wanted to go for this AK. And the last one is the guy that I shot up there. I wonder what happened to the one that was on the roof. I guess he came down. There was definitely one up on the roof over that direction, but, yeah, evidently not anymore. So, you've got a little bit more AK rounds for me. Anything in here of any interest? Oh. Somebody's making a funny noise when I walk around here. Everyone definitely dead, right? I don't know if it's supposed to be the noise of me on these rails, but it had a little click noise, like a blooming mine trying to go off. Hello? Come on, break. Like I say, I'm sure those are the ones that, that break. Shotty rounds I'll take. Saiga's been empty for far too long. And more AK. Speaking of AK, this is rather AK territory, I feel. Nice. Anybody in here? No. Everybody's dead. I'm pretty damn certain of that. Alright, there's some ammo there. I think that was right. Here we go. AK-74 N3 with dovetail mount, mounting optics, and a big mag. Nice. Where's our rubbish one? You. Oops. Let's unload the one we're using and drop it and start using this one and then let's use this mag for the big mag can't get our scope on it yet it's back in the truck but soon enough ah yes and then this this fella really likes his energy drink like really likes his energy drink what are you doing reloading okay that is acceptable why don't you reload with the better rounds yes good choice so yeah, there was a guy standing here. But I don't know what happened to him. Deaded. It's a room with nothing in it. With maps. Maps of where? Don't know. Let me go light for a bit. Oh yeah, we get a truck out of this as well, which is always cool. Truck and whatever we can find in this place, which is ooh, army med kit. Take that. More energy drink. These guys love their energy drink. It's that diet sausages and bandages. 
really not that bothered. And then here is our documents and well, my immersion completely ruined. Oh, hang on, we're getting scenes from the ring and then dogs. Okay, this this is some str is all TV in Russia like this, and then and then we watch the immersion breaking. My is that me or we got here 18 mil and I mean I'll take the standard AK rounds. We'll take the anti rounds because they sell, and let's grab you and. Hmm. The problem with me missing the recording as well is it means you also don't get to see my one-off attempt when I first noted, noticed that, actually I'll, probably, I'll stick this at the end even though there won't be any voiceover for it. The one-off attempt where I spotted this truck and I was still being chased by the helicopter and I tried to drive off in the truck. It's just a shame there won't be any audio for it. Now you guys can probably figure what happened, but it might surprise you still. <laughs> Right, let's get out of here. There was some stuff up in the roof, but you have to sneak around to get hands on that. Have our lights on, probably have our MVs on and actually be able to see as well, but it's all a bit flash. Noise. Uh, right, we've got to turn the mission into Sid first. Don't know which one of these two trucks we'll keep, probably the other one, and just leave this one here as a backup for when we need it. Try not to run any more body down. We killed enough of these guys already. Because I think this truck's in pretty good nick. Right, let's grab you and the site to go with you so that we can immediately. Where are they? Use. And then. Where's the scope? I'm blind. Use. Whee! Nice. Big mag, the whole lot, whole caboodle. <clears throat> well then. Do I repair the barrel immediately? Do we think about repairing our Merc outfit? The barrel seems to be like a good option. Let's grab the repair kit out and see what it's like to... Because um, the barrel's better than that already, isn't it? Almost. Just the bullet protection that's not as good and the barrel's barely repaired, so let's use this outfit. Pair with that, please. I managed to improve the item's condition. Not by very much, but it's still better than this. In every way, pretty much. Cool. So let's put you in there. Let's get you out, because we don't need you. Um, I want to go and sell some stuff, so pack it back in again. Shells in. Let's put our weapons away for now. You're going to get full in a second, aren't you? But it means that I can pull out that, 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 that. And the SVD, because we're not going to need to keep that either. I've got one already. And then we keep the rest of this stuff. Do I take that along and see if I can get Sid to repair it? Blakeney, I can't move, right? <laughs> uh, if I put this on, can I move? Yeah, cheating. Not cheating, really. Also, let's not carry that. I want to sell it. Come on, Sid. Give me my goodies. I said, this gives me way more than I thought it did. Yeah, that would be nice of you. Here's the box. Yeah, 15,000 and an AK 102 2. Which is uh, not as an AK that fires 5.56 rounds, basically. This one. So, yeah, it's been. It's an AK 74, but chambered for the NATO 5.56s. It's just a bit weird. I think that makes it. Just makes it more accurate with slightly better handling than, say, this AK MS. Although that AK MS is shooting big rounds, so fair play. It's not too bad. Trade. Take this rubbish. And the beaten up one of these. Maybe both of these. Sure, take both of them. We've got the barrel now, we're not going to use those. That makes sense. You got anything for me? You got some. You've got 50 slugs. I might actually take some slugs. <laughs> and 14. Yeah, okay. I'll do that. And here I have some. Um, 
from some anti-rads. We've got so many anti-rads, it's ridiculous. You got anything else I want in there, kicking around? Ooh, we could pick up some 19 mil rounds as well. Money-wise, we're looking pretty all right. Yeah. Not bad. Now that's the way to go. Now then, can you uh, please repair the suit I'm wearing? Where is it? Uh, that's transport. Oh, he can't, can he? The guy who does repairing here <laughs> is the one I killed. Well then, won't be repairing anything here, will we? That actually better by miles. I'm worried that we can't repair this. This little symbol here. I haven't confirmed it yet, but that symbol there scares me. It looks like it looks like it's something to do with repairing. Hunting, and I wouldn't put it past the game to mean that that means I can't repair the suit at all. Like it, it's a one use only. A right pain in the ass. Okay, so we got to get up to the bar, basically, which is a bit of a mission. But hey, Stalker's backpack in the bus. We're gonna have to go through here. Is there anything interesting? Grenades and medical supplies. Grenades and medical supplies. What about around here? We got ammo. Ammo. All right, fairly dull. So I guess we take the we we avoid this because it's not worth killing those guys. We take the um, the train path over and get out that way. Haven't done this drive in a while. Yep, this thing's in perfectly good nick, so. As long as I can avoid killing people turning around. Oh, he's already dead. Can't kill him. Ow! Make such a horrible noise. Right. Get out of here. No. Let me turn. The ruts in the road seem to be designed to steer you directly into that poor fella. He could stand somewhere else, I suppose. There is that argument to be made. So, let's keep an eye out for anything hostile looking. Is that, there's just artifacts, just, there's, there's, I can see like three of them, what? All right, oh my God. Uh, are those friendly or enemies? And can I have my shotgun please? Yeah, let's do a tra in fact, my guns. Let's do a trade, I'll put that in there, take out all this lot and put that away as well. Righty then. I, I assume those guys are friends. Very hard to tell from this distance. Let's zoom in. They look like they're friendlies. Let's get our shotty on and go, because I can there's artifacts to be had. Look, there's one there. There's something going on over there. I don't know if it's an artifact or what. There's one there. I'm just walking past them now with so many of these damn things. This is the benefit of coming out at night, I suppose. Actually get to see these things really clearly because they all glint and glow well then let's actual fire coming over uh, fire coming over the red line and boars I don't just two next to each other I mean okay fine I'll do it any more okay looking okay for more here can I spy anything those dudes are over there. There's one there. There's one just right there. Apparently we're going artifact hunting now. That's the thing. And there's one there. Yes, I need to come out at night more often. Now we've got like half decent MVs. Now that's a dag. I don't think you want to bother, Mr. Dag. Are you shooting at me? You, that sounds a lot like you're shooting at me. You could, what, could be shooting at the dag. I'm going to give you the benefit of the doubt. Zombie. No, you're definitely shooting at me. You did not want to go and do that. Look at him. Sneaky little kid. You just sit in the bush and shoot me from there, aren't you? Hmm. This is very much the wrong gun for fighting angry boar. Don't do it. Anyone else want to not? Yep. Yeah. Don't do it. 
It's not worth it. Uh, really? That one definitely bled to death. Like, no question. If I shot him, he didn't die, and then he bled to death. What is going on here? Is this, is this normal at night? Just big patches of artifacts hanging around? Enough of them, but why can't I have my detector out, like, all the time? I know in one of the games, at least, it let you do that with the pistol. You could have the detector in one hand and the pistol in the other, and that made some sense. Oi, 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 no. I quite like the slugs for this gun. I know I didn't to begin with. They're growing on me quite a lot. <laughs> Get done. Yeah, the slugs for this definitely growing on me. Oh, well, continue our search for artifacts just everywhere. That's is that... What on earth is that? What is happening there? Oh, it's a dog pulling a boar. I see. That's why it looks so weird. It's like m mash of limbs and so on. It's dag pulling boar. Okay. Nothing too weird there. Don't! Again, bleeding to death. The dog just triggered that patch, didn't it? That's a bit weird. Oh, God, and it hit me. Not supposed to let them hit you, Wasted, because then you go a bit brain silly. You can't see anything. Uh, That's better. Now we're just swaying instead of losing the plot. Anything down over there? No, I think that's enough of an artifact hunt. For, or I take it back. I take it back. I... I, I would prefer to not be all spinny now. Uh, nom nom nom. That helps, right? Get some food. Drink some water, maybe. <laughs> Doubt that's how it works, but anyway. Ah, thinking about it, this, this is bloodsucker territory. Worth keeping that in mind. Go for it. Oh, come on with the flashy, spinny head, all that rubbish. Enough. <laughs> that delay, though. I mean, hell, they're everywhere. We got this looks like electric ones. Now that's a fireball, stone flower, and a jellyfish. Like we're getting lots and lots of basically exactly the same ones, but that's fine. Scientists will pay me for those. Come on enough being drunk. Or or mind lost or what, what do you call it when they're suffering from psionic hatred weirdness from the enemy? I can't think of a word for it. But it doesn't involve just Swearing, basically. <laughs> oh, are we gonna see a bloodsucker? You gonna come for us, friend? It's night time. This is Hello. Oh Got some tentacles for me? Mm-hmm. Tentacles. Probably a few more shots than I actually needed, but hey, there's something quite nice about reminding the bloodsucker about the <laughs> rapid fire rate of this particular psycho. <laughs> Definitely the best weapon we've picked up so far this game. Used it so much. Well, that was a fairly... Fairly profitable little journey around. Ton of... We got down here, four, six. There's loads of them! Okay, so we're gonna need to... Where are we at? Yeah, we need to go off over this direction because I don't want to go through here and get shot at, so... We are at the bridge, aren't we? Yeah, we are at the bridge. Nope. Off this way. 
not messing around with you guys, aren't we bothered? See if we can find the spot up here to cross over. So if I remember rightly, oh, keep an eye out for artifacts as well. This is an area we haven't searched. If I remember rightly, it's sort of a bit further along than this. Hello, Mr. Boar. Not today, thank you. Try not to drive into any anomalies if we can avoid it, because there are some around here. Where does the fence end? There. That's an artifact we just drove over. I can't leave it. Don't do it, dogs. Where's it gone? Is it stuck under the car? God's sake. I could pick it up in the car there for a second. <laughs> no! That's not good. How can I be overloaded with artifacts? I mean, that is good. Drop. Drop. Drop potatoes. No, more than that. Um, eat. Drop. I did, I'm not in a position where I could open the trunk. Oh, I don't want to have to drop a... I don't have to drop one of these artifacts. I guess I'm going to have to just temporarily in order to get into the blooming trunk in order to unload some of the blooming artifacts in order to take them with us. All right, that's better. To get the artifact there and not the... Okay, let's pick the cheese back up again. Sure, that's what we needed. Right. Let's get moving. Uh, this is the irradiated bit. Oh, for God's sake, I've got two feet and there's another one. I think we can probably get over this anyway if we're quick. Go! Yep. Everything's fine here. Just need to jump out of the car for one quick moment while I uh, just have a little bit of anti rats. Probably be okay. Uh, we're back to not being able to see again, but that's fine. There's more artifact. Game is really taunting me at the moment. <laughs> I seem to remember this being uh, the area where all the I mean, sci, sci fields and so on are. Give, give. Zombie up there. Dog's not bothered. Enemy or a friend, don't know. Probably a friend on the basis that we're still alive. Yeah, that's an anom anomaly, not more artifacts. All right. This is an official, let's get the hell out of here time. Uh, especially as that could well be directed at me. Run away! Run the hell away. That's probably enough. That's probably enough anomalies. Probably enough anomalies. Duh. Probably enough artifact. But slightly distracted by the fact that I was busy driving through an anomaly. Let's see if we can avoid doing any more of that, shall we? So many artifacts out and about. It's awesome. Now, there are definitely anomalies on this road. Where? Check the map, check the map. There's all sorts of stuff going on. There's one there. Don't drive into that one. Uh, looking right for artifacts there, actually. I, was, I would have expected something. Uh, we've got friendlies and one of those. Right, um, let's get back and let the friendlies deal with the dogs and whatnot. Because uh, they're just going to shoot me if I get in there. Or shoot my vehicle, at least. No, dog, no. better. You know what, let's just get in and go through. I'm not messing around. Can't be bothered. What's behind door number two? Friend? Ah, friend. We're okay. Right, I need to move the car forward and sort our inventory out a bit. Because can I already see artifacts just lying around off in that direction. I saw glinting in that direction at least, but maybe it wasn't artifacts. That's an artifact though. Yes, alright. Stop here for a second. Get prepared to be attacked by whatever wildlife decides that it's going to have a go at me while I'm doing my inventory. Ditch you lot. What else is in here that's taken up so much 
wait. Tentacles can go in. Oh, probably doesn't help with the volume of AK ammo we're carrying. Bloody hell. I mean, it's good to be equipped, but that's perhaps a bit too equipped. Okay, that's looking alright. Let's ditch these jellyfish. Not using those either. Plenty of room left in the car. We are getting a lot lighter. Nice. Um, don't need so many bandies. Don't need so many med kits. It's looking okay. It's looking a bit more like it. Got a bit of weight limit now. Didn't actually get attacked by any dags while sitting around. Now then, where's, where's the lead detector? Because I could have sworn I saw something glinting over there. Hello! What, just because I got my detector out, you think it's a good idea? Or are you just you're just doing that to be annoying? No! Oh. For God's sake! Is there something over there? What is this? I, 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 this is not how I would like to aim. Please. This does fade after a while, right? I don't have to drink. I feel like I might have to drink. This, this is making me feel ill. <laughs> oh, it's gone. No, I don't have to drink. It is passing. So let, let, let's just chill a second. Starting to be able to see things over there. I don't know if that's just little ruffles around their feet. I think it might be, actually. It's as they're moving. No, they're... They're playing. Are they playing with an artifact? I can't see! I think that's what they were doing. Is they were playing with an artifact down there. Can you show me a... There's an artifact in that little pool just there. Definitely. And as part of that, these guys are running around like we... Why am I shooting explosive rounds as well? So explosive rounds at dogs that won't die. Come on. Go big shotty time. I want whatever that artifact is. And whatever that artifact is as well. Look, dogs. I'm coming to get the artifact. Okay? It's mine. I want it. Holy hell. Mad radiation. All right, uh, sprint for it. Wow. That bit of train's kind of hot. Screaming, screaming in the distance. Everything's fine. We can also, I can use this as an opportunity to check that bit we have to drive past that's already always full of banditos. That bit there. Looks quite quiet. Oh no, I was about to say it looks quite quiet at the moment, but no, that's, that's the noise of people shooting at things. Normally indicates it's not that quiet. You there, what are you? Mine is what you are. Um, I kind of want to clear this on f on close terms. Normally, normally we go long range for here, but... Oh, hello. Angry dogs. I love how they, they, they have just enough life to be able to jump into your face before you die. Although that one looked like he body slammed me sideways or some rubbish. So did they kill whoever was shooting at them then? Because certainly there's a lack of banditos here and there's a dude with an AK. I think that would be a yes. I'm not seeing much in the way of artifacts though. Oh, there's one over there. Okay, I take that back. What about you? Nope. I suppose that, that makes more sense. Yeah, I can see multiple over here that they'd be around the, the heaps themselves. Big piles of radioactive material just heaped up like this. Yep, gravity, sure. How long can I spend wandering? There's another one that way. There's a 
how long can I spend wandering around grabbing artifacts? It's got to be worth it though, right? All these goodies, all the monies. I might make this the last one, assuming we don't run into anything else obvious on the way, because I could spend all day wandering around here. Yeah, yeah, we'll stop. We'll stop there. No more artifact hunting for now. If I want to artifact hunt in the future, remember, come out at night. If nothing else, it makes them really, really easy to see. <laughs> That's clear. They are friendlies down there. So I don't know. Oh, I see. They've got banditos incoming. Well, as much as I feel for you, I also don't care. So, <laughs> bye. That's a mess just now at the Agrobomb. Many new anomalies appeared. Beware. Okay, not going to Agroprom. We've spent enough time in Agroprom already. Thank you very much. I think this might actually be time to make a sprint for the bar. We are pretty loaded up with stuff. Don't know who they're fighting, but let, let, let's go for it. I wonder if our guys own the middle territory still. We seem to have a pretty good control over that, but yeah, keep an eye on the map, Wasted. There's definitely an anomaly on the road here. Can't remember where. There it is. It's the one on the corner that you want to cut, but really, really shouldn't. So do our friends own this place? They've owned it for a while, but I know I don't have any more goodies left there. I should also try my very best not to look around too much, because I'm bound to see stuff I'm going to want to grab. <laughs> oh yeah, this is still ours. You're right, dudes. I assume in there's us as well. I can see guys, so yeah. Who will the duty be fighting today? I'm sure they're going to be fighting someone new and exciting. They've always got someone to fight when we show up. Yeah, I can see stuff going off in the distance already. There's warfare. There's, there's a controller. Um, okay then. There, shoot it, look. Guys, controller. Oh, this is an opportunity to use something that people pointed out to me in the comments. Controller's got bored, apparently. These guys are all looking the wrong way. What on earth is going on here? Mr. Controller, I have a, I have a present for you. dead? Is he dead? Let's make sure. I think he might be dead. So the, the trick with this gun, as you can see, is I can take it with me. It weighs 30 kilograms, so right now I can't, but in the future, we would come back here with a uh, vehicle, perhaps. We could take that with us. Did we kill the stupid controller with the big mounted gun. We did. Hello. Don't know what you were doing. You've dropped your hand. You've got two or two of your hands. Well, you didn't do that last time, did you? I knew he was going to be there, because of course, as I mentioned, I've done all this multiple times. But he did not drop me a hand last time, which is actually quite important. What on earth? Is that just a weird, no, that's just a weird lit up plant. It's just these guys are all freaking out. They're also my friends now, because I'm friendly with duty, so... I don't need either of those. What's up, guys? Wait, what is freaking you out? I know you're, you're very bothered about something, but what is it? How about if I open the door for you? There's something that way that they're really freaked out over. Know what it is? Okay, so what do we get there? Just more anomalies, really. But a pair of controller hands is super nice. That is a bit of luck because we've also got a burra hand, and we've got 
all of the hands. We've got Burra hands, controller hands, pseudo giant hands. Absolute best selection of hands. Going too far this way is going to end up with radiation death, isn't it? Yo, my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That 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 would be it. Doesn't even give you any any warning, really. It just just does it. Screw it. I am going to. We've got so many anti rads. I'm just going to use it. All right, there we go. I've managed to um find it, whatever it was that was causing the problems. There's bandits, guys. Kill them. Are you throwing grenades at my car? Do not throw grenades at my car! They throw a grenade at my car! That's not acceptable. Have these guys all chilled out now? Did you kill him? Did you kill it? Hello, banditos. It's me. Ah, right. I see. Where are you, Mr. Not Dead? Thank you for your shotgun rounds. We you on your own, really? A bit stupid. Righty then. Get ourselves back in. Fetch our... The car didn't get too beaten up that, that time, thankfully. I'm surprised, given how close the grenade was, but... It's, it's in good enough, Nick, that I don't mind too bad. Work our way through the gate. Just squeeze her through there. Lovely. And then run for it in the hope that more bandits don't show up like about now. <laughs> nope. We're good. Let's go see what is awaiting us on the other side of this loading screen. Aside from the inevitable bad loading in for the car. Are we going to flip? Are we going to fly? What's going to happen? <laughs> there we go. As I was saying. Right. This place is blatantly going to be full of blooming artifacts as well, isn't it? I'm going to ignore them. We're just going straight to the bar. No hanging around. Just make sure you dodge whatever nasties are on the road waiting for us. Is that... That looks like a pair of anomalies. Yeah, yeah. Why are there, like, psi emission anomalies all the way along the road now? Since when is this a thing? And friends up ahead, look! Yay! They're having their own, their own little party. Let's see if we can leave them to that party, not disturb them, because you wouldn't want to crash it, would you, really? Bang! Bang. Yeah, not too bad, I suppose. Uh, Swagger? Hello? Now all I need to do is not kill any of these guys, and we're home scot free. Don't mind me, guys. It's fine. I don't think we've got a car here at the moment. Nope. Sweet. Well then. Turn her off, park her up, and I guess... For now, at least, we're going to want to unload everything we're carrying and go and transport in a bunch of stuff that we can sell, like RPG rockets and grenades and the like. Hand in his X-18 mission, see what he wants next. Let's finish up with that. So, let's ditch our weapons. Trunk is full. Yep, that's fine. We'll bring those. We'll bring those. All right, Ratty, how's it going, man? Uh, I think we can leave our collection of body parts and so on here, because we want those for the scientists. Put the controller hands in as well. Anything else we want to sell? Got some random rounds for stuff that we don't even use in here. Sure, take those with us. Uh, NATO gun? No, I don't have a NATO gun either. And then let's leave behind the rest of our guns. Do it, sell off a whole bunch of the stuff we're carrying, and also hand the mission in and work out what the hell it is we're doing next. Get out of here, stalker. Get out of here, stalker. Ah, uh, I said it first. You got jinxed. 
Oh, I can also go and talk to the duty guys and see if that vendor over there has got anything goody like uh, good for us. See if he's got any I don't think he's, his stock changes very much, but he does have a whole bunch of scopes and whatnot. I might also start using this guy. Because that guy there is the guide and can take us around. Fast travel, basically. And while the vehicles are fine, until we get that opening that lets us get a truck through to Yantar, getting these artifacts back and forward and the body parts and so on is a pain in the backside. We will eventually get away out the back of Agriprom that goes through, but I haven't got it yet. We need to keep doing missions for the scientists. And right now, I can't remember... Well, we failed the last mission for the scientists while we were out because they were centred on that um, quest to find the Burahand that we have. And didn't get back to them in time. Shush. Um, is there anything we need to do in the box? Other than check out our wonderful array of weaponry. Look at that. I don't think so. Got another barrel suit in there. Might be able to use, use that to upgrade ours, perhaps. But for now. Not Sid! Get over here. Yes, I am. You brought the documents from X-18? That I did. Good. The situation is becoming clearer. As I expected, this brain scorcher is man-made. It's a Kamenov experimental emitter, and its components were made exactly in X-18. These documents refer to Lab X-16, where they sent some components. According to this, X-16 is located in the production complex area by Lake the scientists have set up a mobile lab around there, so maybe they can help. Fine, 30k for that. Brain scorcher. It ain't simple. You need to get to the scientists and find out where X-16 is. Okay, sure. Can get the missing Back to the scientists is fine. Why not? Uh, right, let's trade with this idiot and sell him RPG rockets for not as much as I'd really hoped. Honestly, have some grenades. Want to sell him anything else? He doesn't want to buy our ammo. Well, maybe we want to buy his, though. You've got shotty rounds. How can you... Oh, you do have shotgun. I thought he had no shotgun rounds there for a second. He's got no slugs. But he does have standard rounds. Okay, we'll take those. Which, apparently, the 60 shotgun rounds are worth more than three RPGs and three... What? I mean, technically, they're both RPGs, aren't they? That's a grenade that... Anyway. I think that'll be it. Okay, that's it, Sid. Uh, he can repair, can't he? Um, where is it? Personal area, area. To find out something, going repairing things. Oh, I'm not, I haven't got the armor on me, idiot. How much is a full repair? 18k. Not for now. We'll get. We'll find someone else that can do that or get a better suit to do it with. Do I have a better suit already? Probably not better than a barrel. Nah. And I think the duty suit that I've got just can't be upgraded. I'm fairly certain on that one. I take our AK silencer. You have to use subsonic rounds. No, let's not take that then. <laughs> you know what? Let's end it here. We've got to get over to Yantar. I may well fast travel there, but... Given that this seems like a nice clean place to wrap things up, we're done with our X-16 mission and we are in a position to go and chat with them and work out where the hell X-16 is. Psst, it's here. You can tell it's here because this is in it. <laughs> and we want that eventually. <laughs> but yeah, we'll get over to there. If you enjoyed this one, guys, finally out of the way. Fingers crossed, touch wood, I haven't in some way screwed up this recording, then please hit that like button, really helps me and the channel out. If you haven't liked it, then of course, dislike button is right next door. And otherwise, cheers folks, see you next time. Little by little, piece by piece, I take back what's been stolen from me. Little by little, piece by piece, until I'm complete.